I'm Pastel Fractal, and I read this book by Edward St. Alban, On the Edge. This pastel page turner really turned up my consciousness after I discovered this book while I was listening to a Terence McKenna lecture recording circa about 1998, which is the year that this book was published. McKenna was lecturing at the Esalen Institute in Big Sur, California, which is the setting of this book. Terence read a passage from the book, and he mentioned that people in the room while he was lecturing were probably written into this book based on the author's experience there. He wasn't sure if the author would be welcomed back because it was a critical satire of Esalen and the whole New Age movement. McKenna himself is mentioned in the book by a character that claims he is a genius who teaches that the present is caused by the future. I think that's the stranger attractor theory. This book is damn good and very funny. The first chapter had me preparing for disappointment because it was pretty ruthless and the critical of new age folks. But the second chapter locked me right in with a face melting passage depicting a mescaline and psilocybin experience in the Utah desert. The remaining three quarters of the book were also very heady and enjoyable, including nuanced and comical depictions of meditation, personal growth, sex, and environmentalism. My question is, did this author, Edward St. Alban, return to Esalen with any embrace or any friction? Keep turning up consciousness. I'm Pastel Fractal.